Hello and welcome to this week's Pet of the Week at the Kokomo Humane Society. We're joined by Carrot Wolf and Walk It and Horton. Horton. <laughs> I, they're both Dr. Seuss names and their mama's name is Mama, mama Seuss. <laughs> yeah, these kittens were in a foster home and so the kids named them. And they're very, as you can see, well socialized and really friendly cats. That's the beauty of a foster home is that the kittens we get back are always really social and friendly. So we have probably, um, well, Purdue is coming on Wednesday, tomorrow, <laughs> and to do um, some spay neuter for us and we'll probably have about seven kittens available, um, which is really timely because we're gonna have a special this week. Well, you just wanna go play, don't you? <laughs> Okay. Maybe we could trade. Maybe they want to be together. <laughs> well, <laughs> uh, yeah. how old are these kittens? They're eight weeks old. Okay. So they have to be eight weeks old to, in order for us to put them up for adoption. And they've been with their mama and their siblings all this time, which is really important for both kittens and puppies just to get them socialized. And, um, and now they're ready to be fixed. They have to be two pounds and um, eight weeks in order to get spay or neutered. Okay. And what what is their adoption fee? Um, well, their adoption fee is 130, except that we're having a adoption special starting on Thursday, a tax a tax sale, a, a tax return adoption special. And we're gonna have a wheel and you spin the wheel and it tells you what percentage you get off on your on your adoption fee. So as low as ten dollars, but definitely lower than one thirty. So it just depends on your luck. And since these kittens are pretty young, is there any special accommodations or any special care that they need? Maybe food or anything in that kitten regard? chow. Um, we um, kitten chow and a litter box and um, things. That they can climb and get into pretty much anything, but. Uh, not in any spot you just want to handle them a little they're babies you want to handle them a little more gently if you have children you want to teach them to be gentle with them but no they're just they're pretty sturdy um and we never recommend spa uh declawing cats it's a kind of a brutal surgery but there's ways to, if you haven't had cats or if you haven't had indoor cats, get them a scratching pole or something to scratch on, something to climb on. They really like vertical spaces. So if you do that, those kind of things, they're going to stay away from your, tend to stay away from your furniture and your curtains and things like that, as long as they have somewhere to go. So if you go on Pinterest, there's tons of really cool uh, climbing things. You can screw it into your walls and or you can get freestanding poles or whatever, but those are really a great thing to keep them occupied. Okay. Okay, so we have plenty of kittens because it's the beginning of spring. Right, yes. We have a lot of kittens in um, foster right now. We'll have probably seven or, or so that'll be available for adoption and they'll keep coming. So again, um, kittens are wonderful, but too many are too many. So if you have a cat, get it spay or neutered so that we don't have um, too many of them. And we'll be having kittens from now on through the summer. And so if you're looking for one, we will, we have this special now and then we'll continue um, throughout. But um, they're a lot of fun, get two. <laughs> and they do play well in pairs. Yeah, they're, it's nice for them to have company. So, uh, it's, it's a with the adoption special, be a great time to get two. But we also have full grown, lots and lots of full grown cats, and we've got nice dogs. And so, um, just come in and look around. The special is Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And um, but you're welcome to come in today or tomorrow uh, to check out who's available and um, we, we can't put holds on the um for the adoption special but you can come and look or if you just have to have that one which is um it's good to get who you want then you can pay the full adoption fee which is still a deal okay. 
Okay, so that's been the pet of the week at the Kokomo Humane Society. And as we always say, there's no guarantee that Wocket or Horton will be here, but there's always someone looking for their forever home.